Hey everybody, welcome back. Let me tell you about the best steak deal that I know in Las Vegas. No, it's not the cheapest, but it's the best deal. You get the best value for your money. This is off the strip. If you know where the Palms Hotel is, it's just about five, 10 minutes to the west of it. This is a video poker lounge called Jackson's. Jackson's Bar and Grill. Details are in the description if you wanna see the menu and the address and the location, everything. I almost didn't wanna post this because I didn't wanna share. This is one of the best places I know. It's so cozy. It's not the biggest place, but it's fairly decent sized, has a dining area, and you can smoke in this area. It's part of the bar, the video poker lounge, but they do have a non-smoking section sectioned off. This is off the strip, but it's not too far. And this is a really comfortable place a video poker lounge, you can eat at the bar, they have the most friendliest people. This is a place where you really do feel like you're part of the family. And every time I stopped here, I usually won something. And every time you hit $200, you get a free spin on their machine, where you can win even more bonuses. And they have all kinds of perks and specials and deals. And they even sent me a flyer or a mailing that says I get 50% off and $20 free in slot play. So they have a lot of extras here that would make this an ideal place for your hangout. But the food here is why I really come here. Their steak deal is one of the best, like I said. It's a one pound ribeye steak for $20. Las Vegas has a lot of great steak places, especially if you're on the strip, but they are expensive. There are so many that I can't list all of them, but I'll show you a few from my playlist. You can find them on my YouTube channel. There's all kinds of steak places, but a lot of them are so expensive. You can't eat there every day, but if you're a tourist, it's understandable because that's why you're here to see all the fabulous sights and sounds of Las Vegas and experience the best and the lavish and extravagant lifestyle of Las Vegas or the image that it represents. There's nothing that can really compare to a fine steakhouse, but you're also gonna pay for that fine quality too. And a lot of the steakhouses, they have a la carte menus where you're paying extra for the baked potato, you're paying extra for the shrimp cocktail, and some of the baked potatoes and the sides get really expensive. For instance, you might pay 10 to $15 for a baked potato. And some of the seafood sides or add-ons or appetizers like seafood towers can be $100, shrimp cocktail for $25. These are some exquisite places though. The quality is good, I must admit, like this Chateaubriand at the Red Rock. Incredible. But if you're a visitor to Las Vegas, you might pay those prices. But if you're living here and you're a local, sometimes it gets kind of crazy. So we look for local places for local deals. Bob Taylor's Ranch House serves up really good grilled steaks. You can find this video on my channel. And there are some other steak deals around Las Vegas that might be a little bit cheaper. But then some of the cheap deals, the quality is not that good. A long time ago, before COVID, and before inflation, you used to be able to find some great steak deals, prime rib deals. Now it's like Ellis Island is one of the best, but the quality has been kind of going down according to some of the reviews I've read. There's also the South Point Hotel, which also has steak deals, but sometimes you're restricted by the time because it's only during graveyard special hours, which is like midnight to 6 a.m. And sometimes the quality is not that good. You can't always order a medium rare steak and expect a medium rare. A lot of times you wind up telling yourself, I got what I paid for and it's a hit or miss. Here at Jackson's, I really do feel like this is the best steak deal. It's a quality steak for a reasonable price. $20 for a one pound ribeye, sides included. You can find cheaper deals in Las Vegas, but you're also gonna find cheaper quality steaks. The steaks aren't gonna be good. If there's one word that describes this place is comfortable. I keep feeling comfortable here every time I come. From the hospitality of the staff and the food just coming out perfect every time. Like there are wings. I love the classic hot wings. And this is your classic Las Vegas style hot wings 
where you get a whiff of it and it makes you cough because it's so potent with the vinegar and the hot sauce and a side of ranch. Currently, as of the date of the video, it's $16 for 10 weeks. They come out perfect, hot and crispy outside, perfect amount of sauce, no breading, just fried till it's crispy outside, tender and moist inside with just the right amount of sauce, the way it should be, your classic buffalo style hot wings. Some places try to do too much with the wings. They come up with all kinds of sauces. Sometimes they're breaded and it's just not as good. This takes me back to the old Vegas, the classic wings. And there are some other places that still have really good wings, but Jackson's hot wings are perfect. Another thing about this place is that most of the things on the menu are available 24 hours a day. Except the baked potato, I think starts at 12 noon. I'm not sure what time they stop serving the baked potato, but as far as I know, it starts at 12 noon. But this is their one pound ribeye steak for $20. I ordered a baked potato, but you can get it with other sides if you want. I ordered my steak medium rare, so if you don't like medium rare, then you probably won't like the images. I will say this, that it comes out perfectly medium rare. This is one of those rare places where they know how to cook the steak perfect almost every time. If you've ever tried steak deals in Las Vegas or the graveyard specials, you know that the steak is not going to be that good. It might be okay. It might be terrible. It might be just shoe leather. But the steak here is really good. It's a quality steak. It's not steakhouse, but almost. It's really good. And you can also get it as part of a steak and eggs available 24 hours, along with other breakfast items available 24 hours. You get the same 16 ounce ribeye steak with eggs, hash browns, toast. This is one steak and eggs meal that leaves me satisfied. Now, if you're a small eater, they also have eight ounce steaks available. I believe the eight ounce is a New York steak, but I usually will get the bigger steak, whether it's a New York or a ribeye. And this time I ordered my steak medium and guess what? It came out perfectly medium, just a little more done than the medium rare, slight pink, hot center, perfect. And the steaks are so good here. It kind of like lingers in my mind the next day. And I find myself craving the ribeye steak at Jackson's again. And I know I don't have to pay 80 to a hundred dollars for my steak. And I don't have to go at 2 a.m. or 5 a.m. to get the steak deal. This is an overall best value for your money steak deal. It's affordable and it's really good. A 16 ounce steak nowadays for $20 is hard to find, almost impossible. Now they do have other items on the menu. I wouldn't say their menu is extensive, but they have your classics and decent amount of food, like their fish and chips. These are cod fillets, so good quality fish and fried perfectly, as well as the onion rings, fried crispy, perfect. It wasn't greasy or oily. Some places the fish and chips come out greasy and oily. That wasn't the case here. Perfect. There's something about food at bar and grills. Is it because I'm drinking? Everything tastes better? No, I wasn't really that far gone in any of my trips here. The food was actually really good, like their burger. How about a nice, thick, juicy cheeseburger cooked the way you like it? Every once in a while, I still get a craving for a Big Mac because I grew up on Big Macs, but it's the incredible shrinking patty. Pretty soon, all you're gonna taste is the secret sauce. The patties are paper thin. Not so here. You get a nice, thick, juicy patty. As of the date of this video, it's $14 for a regular cheeseburger like this one. So it's not a cheap burger, but it's gonna be a lot better than your fast food places. It's your classic cheeseburger like it should be. I also tried their Philly cheesesteak. That's because they were out of the beef dip. I believe the beef dip uses a different kind of meat and they were out of it. So I got the Philly cheesesteak. This one I would say is tasty. It's just lacking a little bit in the meat. I wish they had a double meat deal because there were some empty spots in that bun or the roll. Currently, Jackson's is the best place that I know for a steak, a 16 ounce ribeye for $20. If you know of any other steak deals in Las Vegas, 
better than this one, please leave it in the comments below because I'm going to want to check it out. But for now, this is the best deal that I know in Las Vegas for a steak. So that's going to do it for me here at Jackson's. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video.